Hey folks, please enjoy this clip from our show, which you can find every single day at 4 p.m. Eastern exclusively on Rumble. We've been doing the best shows we've ever done, completely free of censorship and on a platform that actually supports us. You can also support us on Locals where you can access a ton of exclusive content, movie riffs, as well as an archive of over a thousand full episodes going back as far as seven years. We've also teamed up with Merch Engine to bring you a new lineup of really awesome quality shirts, hoodies, and now even hats. So come check out our untested uncensored show on Rumble every single weekday at 4 p.m. Eastern. You stupid idiots. But speaking of people that are really funny, what do you think about Brendan not doing comedy anymore? Comedy anymore? Oh, Brendan Schaub retired. Yeah, he's mm. retired. You know what? Go out on top, I say. That's what I say. Well, I like the way he retired because he did it in the reverse order of how you're supposed to be a comedian. Mm -hmm. He started with a Showtime special and playing theaters. And then he went, you know what? I'm just going to do my local club and just work shit out now. It's like, yeah. well, that's what you should have been doing all this time. You were performing at theaters and having shitty specials on yeah. TV. When the world was handed to you. Yeah. Yeah, dude, he had everything. And then he was like, okay, he, he's done now. I, I guess he's just doing that uh, show that he does with Brian Callen at gunpoint. What, what is it? <laughs> no, he, he does... Um, the oh god what what's the other one he does with uh chris delia the golden hour oh god they're oh, still doing yeah, that the, and the black guy the, from workaholics uh, yeah 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 Go. yeah eric griffin who by the way is a nothing eric griffin adds nothing thank to that you show. dude we were saying Garfin. that uh it, it, it it's he's just that he's just there so they can make black jokes Yes, uh, see, yeah, the Robin you. Quivers of that show. Here you, go, yes. here you go. You know what? Why not? Let, let, why don't we do an impromptu check-in real quick on the Golden Hour? God, I, mean, I forgot about the Golden Hour. We have I've it covered a... it a couple times on WATP. It is so bad because these West Coast comedians never Dude, say he... anything. <laughs> they never make a joke. No, they just do noises and sing songs. Bro, bro, <laughs> West Coast. No, here's the thing. You'll agree with me, West Coast comedians, right? West Coast comedians immediately go into therapy talk, like right away. Mm -hmm. Like if you've ever like, if, for example, look at look at like New York comedians and their podcast. They're all pieces of shit to each other. They're all fucking assholes. And that's just Louis J. Gomez. And then if you, I love Louis, by the way, but but yeah. then if you look at if you look at the West Coast comics, it's, it's all therapy talk and like crying and shit like that. And they're all so phony to each other. They're always like, oh, no, I thought you were great. Yeah, you were so good. And meanwhile, good. like, you know, New York comics are like, yeah, nice special, stupid. Yeah, you fucking like, suck, <laughs> you piece of shit. You know? And you're like, I prefer that, you know? <laughs> so this, th let's, check, let's check on the Golden Hour. Diamond on Guys, know. on the smart TVs, mm -hmm. you could get local news. Mm -hmm. on, I have a sense. You said he provides nothing. He just sells wow. smart TVs. So you, you know what? Local news. Checkmate, you, you know, Carl. You know checkmate. what? Checkmate. You are right, Eric. You can get local news on the smart TVs. <laughs> Christ. Show, <laughs> this is nothing. It's just three guys just trying to fill an hour. That's all it's this is. So bad. They know they made a mistake. They were like, about oh, what? About paying some like, of these podcasters like, the like amount Call of money. Caller Daddy, uh, Dak Shepard, uh, oh. all the podcasts they toss, toss a ton they didn't, of money at. They didn't do it. No, they went, we're good. Does they anyone let anyone that. talk no. on this show? Like, no. they literally take turns interrupting no, each other. No, they, the problem is they're on so much Adderall. <laughs> really? They just take turns interrupting each other. It's so bad. Also, I don't know what the, I mean, we, obviously we just came into this, so I don't yeah. understand the context. I think what they're saying is that Spotify fucked up and overpaid for some podcasts. These are all people who, well, not Eric Griffin, but the other two, are millionaires from having shitty podcasts no one cares about. No, no, no. And not only that, and also being involved, and then Brendan Schaub was the one that was involved in that podcast company that wasn't paying people. Correct. Oh, yes, podcast he's got, he's got like 1.6 million. Yeah. yeah. Podcast. One. Dude, the fact that he we're going to pay him 1.6 million should boil your blood, right? It should boil your blood that he's getting that money for being clinically retarded. This is why we always avoid like these kind of like networks and like rev share things. And like anytime somebody comes sniffing around the show, we're like, yeah. fucking beat it. Get out of here. Pay us Not first. Signing anything. Pay with us you. first. Yeah. Well, maybe all, yeah, all of it. Not with this, but like no, 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 I'm saying, everything. That's probably yeah. put him over the top, man. Got to be. The last deal was more, probably more than we're, they're, they're even letting on. I don't know, and he was dude. making something like thirty or forty million dollars a year from from YouTube. It's not more than they were letting on. They have to file like these things with the SEC. They have they, they have, they're not hiding paying him. They this is a large sum, okay. <laughs> I don't know if you know this, but you could get the <laughs> local news on the Roku. All right. Thank you. you know, thank you so much. Listen to the idiots speculate on shit. This is yeah, fun. For, for somebody who supposedly has never drank or done drugs in his life, Crystal Lee looks rough. Yeah. Yeah.
touring in arenas. Yeah, touring yeah, in arenas. That's you got to be close. And, uh, and uh, by the way, yeah. because of who he is and the influence, he's got business connections. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's probably that, that, involved. He has stuff. investments. Yeah. Then don't. He's not just sitting there being What's like, the but, what is don't this pre- show? I don't. No, but I will say this. Oh, how does I'm getting angry? Seventy-seven thousand views, four hundred and twenty thousand subscribers. Well, and those numbers have been plummeting. This show used to be a show with Theo Vaughn. Yeah, he wisely got the fuck out of the way. He's like, I don't want to be near Brendan Shaw. Not only that, by the way, he Theo's, fucking left California. He goes, I'm going to go live in Nashville. Theo's Thank got, you Theo's very got much. a fucking rocket ship strapped to his back lately. Oh, yeah, he's killing it. He he's just, killing he just it. cut this dead weight, and like I, we saw him at the UFC thing. Oh remember? Yeah, yeah, he was uh, we, like he's been making fucking moves. He's fucking bro. interviewed fucking Tucker, Tucker Carlson, like yeah, dude, like he got he yeah. dumped these fucking losers and moved on. Theo Good for made him. so many smart moves, and this show when Theo was on it used to get four hundred, five hundred thousand views every episode, yeah. and now it's seventy-seven thousand. Still, is way too many for these assholes. Yeah. But yeah. It's my a pretty goodness, big decline. Forget he sold on it. Yeah, but I bet you didn't know all the facts about Roku streaming, so think about that. Paid paid more money than Spotify. Thank you. Oh, really? Yeah. He's got to be close to it. Yeah, then yeah. That's why he's he's getting rid of his truck, and I want want his truck. By the way, I I know you say that uh, Eric Griffin doesn't add anything to this show, but Chris D'Elia also does not add anything to this show. Mm -mm. It's a lot of, yeah, uh uh-huh, wow, yeah. He subtracts. Did Uh you guys just hear Brendan Schaub talking about how he wants to buy Rogan's truck? Yeah. Yeah. The other thing that Shab is doing is this show about cars now. Did you know about that? Don't say that to me. Are you serious? <laughs> no, the fuck not. No, for real? Oh, oh my God. I can't my... believe you don't know this. No, no. Brendan Shab's doing a car show, Papa. Uh, what is it called? I got to look it up now because I have not. Car- actually... I'll find it. I'll find it. Dune, I'll find it. Toontown. Oh, T U N E. Yes. To, oh, Mersh. Oh, you're going to love it. I'll, I'll pull up for you, Mersh. I, my, so the, my, my, I, I don't know hurts. much about cars myself. All I know is that he knows nothing about them. He can't even change his own oil, and he started a fucking show about cars. 4,000 subscribers. First episode of Toontown. Town. Okay, here, let's Wow, 4,000 subscribers. Wow. Oh, God, he's doing the royalty-free YouTube. Oh, my God. Oh, this is going to be good. Is that the famous raptor that he, uh, <laughs> the famous raptor? Yeah. The wall, the wall to my truck. Wall, wall, wall to my truck. He like, he's, he's like a, how old is he? Like a 30, what, 30, the mid thirties? He's Almost like a, 40. He's think, like a 40 yeah. year old zoomer, like wannabe. It's so bad. It's so embarrassing. I, I want to hear his intro. It's going to be good. It's going to be good. Here we go. I'm, I'm sure it's going to be great. I uh, upgrade the exhaust. Of course, the exhaust. I upgraded the exhaust. Of course, the exhaust. Okay. I did a JMB intake, but nothing crazy out there. Okay, no, no. But I, but what I want him is explain what they do. Yeah, what did you do? No, though? no, no. I want him he to... He didn't just... do any of this. Yeah. He gave I, some money. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I upgraded nothing. Especially for you mod freaks. 705 horsepower. 650 mod pounds. Of... Yeah, yeah. You know what? Brendan Shop car guy. I like this. I like this journey for him. You know why he couldn't do comedy? He was too into cars. Now he's basically like Jay Leno, but without the you know comedy career, or mm-hmm. late night talk show, or cars. I go to the dealership. I go to the dealership. They tell me the specs of the car, and I'm like, I'm a mod freak. Don't I'm, bother. Like, look at me. Look at me, guy. Look at my hat. It says mod freak. Bro, I'm sick. Yeah. I'm sick like that, bro. Yeah, I'm fucking look at numb. the shoes. I bet he calls the tires shoes at some point. <laughs> he does. He's gonna call them shoes. Torque. It has a 6.2 liter supercharged engine. Also, engine, because that's, that's hey guys, I don't know. That's mechanic talk. It's super powered engine, you know. <laughs> no, it's the Hellcat, as we like to say on the streets. We, we, look, all this, you know what? All this gearheads. He's a street guy. He's a oh, street God. car guy. All this gearheads. Oh, this is amazing. Thank you. Car. This is amazing. We're, we're going to watch this. I can't believe we didn't know about this. No. It's like a birthday present. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so the plan is is to get this stock Sandblast Limited Edition TRX to over 1,000 horsepower. Why? Why? <laughs> it's, for what reason? It's a truck. I can't do it on my own. That, so way, re- that way, Annie Letterman will never outrun me. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> well, also, it's like an extended cab trunk. It's like, I could fit my newborn back here. <laughs> yeah. We can pack some stuff for vacation and a thousand horsepower. What are you doing? Like, he does. Like, he the fuck is, is building a deck at his house that he needs a fucking pickup truck. <laughs> Shout out to some of the very best in the business. I am headed to Sacramento. Are you re is he's reading? He's reading this part and he's so stupid. California to visit my boys at Overkill who are going to turn this thing into the Demon TRX. Let's go. I hate this. I hate the music. I hate I hate how it's edited like a fucking terrible like TLC show. I hate this. All right, here's the good news. Mm -hmm. He is losing money on this show. Good. Oh, yeah, that's 4,000 subs, dude. To be. And that to goes be. to show you, like, you know, because it's easy to have, like, a channel that, you know, you, you built up with Theo Vaughn that, you know, it, anybody knows with YouTube, right? You'll gain subs than people that, like, you know, either they lose their account, they'll get locked out of it, they die, whatever. But there's a lot of people that don't unsubscribe from your old channel. So the best indicator of whether or not you still got any juice is when you start a new channel and you right. start hyping it. And you're like, guys, get over there. And that's when you get a real example of like what you can still pull. Yep. Made it. Made it five and a half hours. LA to Sacramento to see the boys that overkill. A lot of beef jerky. A lot of big gulps. We left at 6 a.m., but we made it. I'm you so drove excited. five hours, and you had to stop for how many big gulps in, in beef jerky? I'm, I'm sorry. I, I also failed to believe that there's not an, a, a truck modding place in Los Angeles. Not one that'll pay them. Yeah. Oh. All right. Or do the work for free. Not one that'll do the yeah. work for free. That's what we're figuring out here. How's it going, brother? Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Does this seem yeah. like yeah. Brendan Schaub learned how to have a personality from watching television? No, no that's exactly right. <laughs> that's not, this he's is like a, the Guy Fieri of like car shows. I was like, hey, what, this is what's happening, everybody. <laughs> Just had some big golf, some beef jerky. Now we're gonna do this. It's like what's... that fucking what was the uh, the oh god fucking Shane Gillis had a really funny one, the grill sergeant, the grill sergeant, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and he just keeps having fucking flashbacks. <laughs> this is so uh... hey, man. Yeah, Joe Everyman, just having big gulps and, and a beef jerky, driving your $90,000 truck to put a $40,000 mod on it. Yeah, no, it yeah. sounds great. Yeah, Brendan Everyman. Yeah. Appreciate you guys coming out. Yeah, he's like, yeah, man, it's going to be about, you know, six hours or something. like, that sounds uh, right. Drive and that I was like, bitch like Hunter Biden, oh, man. I figured, what drive does that time? mean? Try, drive that bitch like Hunter Biden? What does that is, mean? Is Joe Biden, is Hunter Biden known for his, his driving skills? Well, I mean, I think he means like fucking hookers. How does that? How will that get you to Sacramento faster? I don't know how be well, pff, I don't know, the same way that he got two oh, specials. Crack maybe a speed? I don't know. Maybe that's what it is. You guys also, maybe a cool brand. Maybe it's not a cool brand. DP it doesn't seem like it'd be a very cool brand. I don't brand. think DP you don't think DP is a cool brand? DP is a very cool brand. Hear me out. Ass to mouth. <laughs> Stop at least once. We stopped twice. Stop twice and still once for gas and then once for being tricky. We're still talking about this. Yo. You know, the point of these videos, you're supposed to cut to, like, the interesting part. But I know it's Brendan's shop, so that's going to be really difficult to cut to the interesting parts. <laughs> yeah, yeah. so, Brendan, so what we're going to be doing here is we're going to be adding, like, a NAS system to the truck, right? The beef jerky was teriyaki flavor. It was tender. <laughs> I, I think it was Alberto. And then I mixed, like, two kinds of soda in the uh -huh. They let you do that. You know they let you mix two kinds of soda? They let you. There was construction in San Jose. I got so <laughs> down. <laughs> so I got off the 401, and I had to take the alternate route through the valley. So that added some I'm time. surprised he didn't film his entire five-hour commute to Sacramento. <laughs> I heard he's pretty good. Bro, this good. fucking I show sucks without Exhibit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Trust him. Immediately crashes. That, that would be, would be so the best thing funny. in the... Just <laughs> fucking total it in the parking lot. I. You know what it is? I, I, I hate... Everything about this, like people that do this, that have trucks like this, yeah. that do burnouts like this, it's everyone in this video is hateable. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to film the whole burnout. Who edited this for him? Go. I felt safe. Everyone says that. Deal. It makes me feel so good. Everyone feels safe when they get in the car. Now when we get in that car. 
Okay. So it's just just, just going to be him. This is just your big fun day at the car shop. Taking little rides in his vehicle. Dude, it's uh, Tokyo Grift. <laughs> <laughs> Too fast, too, yeah, great. Too, too fast, too stupid. Fucking <laughs> Tokyo <laughs> Grift. It's fucking hilarious. Oh, fuck. It's about family. Lying to your family. This is Irish Sharp in the chats. This is the end result of nobody ever telling him no. No, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. I like how he points out he has a black friend. He's the You've done injectors. All that to this truck. Everything's done to this one. This is this bad boy moves. Daily driven. If you look in the back, we got the car, the baby seat back yep, there, and everything else, seat, just packs. like you. Yep. This, I, dude, Brendan, my favorite thing is he's got that. Um, there's a word for it too, where he repeats everything you say. It's actually a mental disorder. I forget what it's called, but it's actually a known mental disorder. People that have this, um, this just they repeat back everything you say to them. Like, I don't know if you remember Carl. Um, but there was a guy in The Sopranos that did it. Fucking Albert Breeze from The Sopranos. Yes. He'd be like, yeah, can you believe that he would just leave, stand him up like that? Yeah, I know. Can you believe he would just stand him up like that? Like, it's, I forget. Somebody look it up. It's called something. But it, it's literally fucking, that's what he does. He just repeats things back out loud. You know what'll help? With the baby seat. You, know, you know why you didn't like that? Because you didn't have this rock star here. So I didn't have this rock star here? Okay, don't do that. <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just like, what is wrong with you? Well, it's because you don't have a personality. Yeah. So you're trying to figure out. How, that's the whole thing with Brendan Schaub in every scenario. He's trying to figure out how he works into that, whether he's on with Fighter and the Kid or he's on this show. He's constantly trying to be like, I fit in, right, guys? Right, guys? I'm one of you guys, right? We're hey, all hanging hey, out together, hey, right? Look, we're all mod heads here. You know, we're all gear junkies. Yeah. We're all whatever fucking thing. Uh, uh, <laughs> it's called echolalia. Echolalia. It's, it's, it's an actual thing. Yeah, when pe they, 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 it's Shit. a very rare thing, but yeah, they have a word for it and everything. And people, that, and you've everyone's met somebody like that. They're just like, yo, yeah, yo. Yeah. Rocks to the baby seat. Everyone's met somebody like that. <sighs> yeah, fucking Christ. These, these, Some people were just guessing in the chat. It's called being a fucking idiot. No, that's not. <laughs> Close. <laughs> okay, you know what I just noticed? So behind him, does every like guy have like, like keepsakes? Is that like a picture of Eric and his like wife on the right behind him? And then on the left, right. it's Brendan and his wife? Yeah, they're all really trying to like uh, front lash after Dalia's bullshit. Yeah. Like, hey, we fucking love our wives, dude. Oh, Dalia yeah, yeah. talks about his kid on this show nonstop. He's such a family guy. He just can't get enough oh, of his family. Yeah, yeah, Bro, yeah. like you said, he looks, he look, for someone who's sober, he always looks so strung out. Yeah. Yeah. He's, it's kind of well, like, he's a sex addict. He's in recovery. Yeah. It's kind of yeah. like CM Punk is another guy that was straight edge, supposedly an athlete, and he always yeah. looks like shit. He always looks like shit. Yeah. He would, he's not rich, rich, but he would have, he would be, give people cars and shit. And, and that's, and that's like, rich. Maybe that Chris, I know your dad was like CIA, <laughs> HBO guy, or I don't know, it's Talon's dad's CIA. I know your dad was like a big HBO fucking producer and everything. So you, this is what we always joke about. The like out of know, touch, yeah, completely just go, out of touch. Just go to the store, buy a hammer. What's it, five hundred bucks? Yeah, yeah, here you go. No, but it's true. It's like he's not rich. He could just give cars away. <laughs> <laughs> Look, if, the moment I could give a car away, I am then rich. Do you understand me? Here, have, here. you know what? Having a rough time? Take my Corvette. I don't That's need fine. it. You can have it. I'm not rich. I'm a poor man. You know, I once saw a man who had no Corvette. That's why he's <laughs> never gotten to the next... Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'd be too wild with him. Like, even You're so wild. Everyone calls you wild, Brendan, because he's just crazy. Like, I saw him at a party and he put a lampshade on his head. Isn't that crazy? And he's like, I'm wild. a lamp. I'm a lamp. That's great. He's truck hat. He's all trucks now. Yeah. No, yeah. Oh, he's... You're thinking of his stand-up set, actually, oh, Royce. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Good point. Good point. Even now, I'm not. Yeah, I'm, that's what I'm saying. Like, I got to hustle, dude, to make ends meet. Mm. But, like, yeah, because yeah, you... you lost Theo. We know. <laughs> We know. <laughs> I gotta hustle. I'd be fucked if I if I lost Theo Vaughn too. I'd be fucking scrambling. Mm -hmm. You're like, dude, I love this watch. Mm -hmm. okay, you can have it. It's weird, dude. He's such a good guy. Did he? Okay, so what you said. I think it's even more than just saying back what people say. Somebody else said, "Oh yeah, Rogan's a nice guy, or whoever this is a nice guy. He's not rich, but he'll just like give your car to somebody." And then Brendan's like, yeah, I have to work hard. I also have to work hard to make ends meet. Like one time I just gave a guy my watch. Uh -huh. Like he always, he's a one upper. He always has to like be better than the other person. Not, yeah, I'm, that's what I'm saying. Like I got to hustle, dude, to make ends meet. Mm, but like yeah. even if you're like, dude, I 
love this watch. Mm. Like, okay, you can have it. It's weird. Nobody dude. does I, that. Nobody's ever done that. No. No. I've never just been like, yeah, you can have my watch if what you, you like it so much. What are you talking about? Also, when I compliment something that you have, it's not because I want you to give it to me. No, I'm just saying it's a nice watch. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just happy for you. But everything's a lie. Like, yeah, he also threw his jersey at a kid and he said, here you go, kid. And he mm -hmm. drank a Coke with him and stuff. Like, yeah, <laughs> it's, that's, that's him. That's the guy. That's Brendan. I, you know, I don't. I that's don't... why we're not billionaires. Maybe, though. That's why. <laughs> <laughs> we're too generous. That's the problem. That's why we're not. Yeah, Brendan. That's why you're not a billionaire. I hate him. <laughs> you don't get rich by writing checks, Royce. I hate his guts. <laughs> what an asshole. That's why you're not a billionaire, Brendan. That's the reason why you're not See, a billionaire. I, I don't know. We're not millionaires because we're too Christ like. <laughs> you know? Giving away too many watches. <laughs> yeah, that's your problem, Brendan. All the watches you're giving away. It's not oh. the hundred grand you're wasting on fixing up a truck. <laughs> Holy fuck. I love that. That's why I'm not a billionaire. I'm just too kind. Maybe, though. No, no. I mean, that's, that's why, why Patrick Bet David is so rich. He never gives watches away. He never gives watches cars. away. No, at all. Billionaire. But, like, maybe that's what. Sorry. But maybe that's what. Like, yeah, this guy does it, but this guy does it as a business. But his Mr. is a Beast. business. So he'll be like, we're giving out yeah. whatever. 40,000 cars. I always and then wonder about that. And they give I always, it to him. I always wonder about that. I always wonder about somebody who's just like kind. Like, I don't I don't have feelings. So like, I don't know what that's yeah, like. I'm an actual know? psychopath. Right, if you read so, any of the allegations yeah. about me, uh, I'm pretty much a psychopath. I'm pretty crazy. So I don't get it. I don't understand how people can just be caring and kind, you know? He's doing the Lord's work. Rich, he gets a lot of hate. Rich, rich people don't do shit like that. They're not like us, dude. Well, we don't know. That's what, no, they're, well, they're the sad. They're, they're, they're just common guys. They're, they're not like us. They're, they're common not like, they're not like, they're not like these three ham and eggers. Yes. The son of a plumber, baby. Yeah, <laughs> they're so humble. It's I, like, it's weird. On. Like It's weird when you're like so kind, giving away like all this cool stuff. Like, you're so kind and so humble, but your dick is so big. I know, I know. You know that's yeah, got to be so hard. That's the problem, you know? Uh, <laughs> fucking Jesus fuck. Christ. These people are... Mm, L.A. comedy, man. L.A. comedy's the worst. Oh, don't? I I'm with And them. I'm not saying they should or shouldn't. I'm just saying they don't, and it's interesting. They're yeah, savages. But like, 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 I have a buddy, billionaire. Mm-hmm. Through a dinner and who's I was, your billionaire okay, buddy? Now Which only, one? What's his name? There's only like hundred billionaires. What's his name? So we should be able What's to narrow name? this down. Who's your billionaire buddy? Because Actually, I know the answer to this. It's Tom Segura. That's who he's talking. <laughs> <laughs> he did look like he had money in that uh, Vegas. In that video. Vegas video, and he's smoking a cigar with the boys. No, just normal comics. That's the oh my god. The moment we started, comics started acting like rock stars. That, that's it. That's when it got bad. The moment they started. I, Comics were better when they were all miserable fucks. Now that they're oh, all rock stars, that's because you're poor, you're a poor. That's oh, why you're you poor, talk right. like that. Yeah. That's why we're not billionaires, Carl. Because I'm always giving away these free shows. <laughs> mm -hmm. They should all be behind a paywall. That's why we're not billionaires. Well, that that, minute, that, and our big, uh, not, that and our big watch giveaway. Last our big month. we've been giving out watches. That giving, costs we've us been a giving, fortune. They're Invicta watches, but they add up. Like the number of them, mm -hmm. they add up. Guys, like, I got to say, um, I believe you're both coming on WTP on the 24th, yeah, right? Yeah, uh, yes, that's the plan. Okay, I, I think we need to do a deep dive into Toontown and Golden Hour right. and Fire the Kid. I think we need to probably look a little bit further into what Brendan Shaw's been up to lately. I Thanks. definitely want to check in on Fighter and the Kid, too, because that's another it's one. Been a, really it's been a while since we've done that. But it, Same dude, here. I haven't looked at that in, in a year. I too. love watching how miserable Brian Callen is. It's like one of my. It's it's literally like therapy for me. And he, he well, it's Brian Callen's like the big brother, who like doesn't want you to pick out his his brother. And he's just like, yeah. hey, you don't mean that, right? Hey, all right, hey, you're cool, you're cool.